everyone. My name is Missy. Some of you guys know me, some of you don't. Um, we are coming live to talk to you guys about some amazing opportunities going on right now. I seriously am so excited about this. So I want to start by introducing our first speaker, who is Nikki. She is amazing, guys. You are going to love her. So Nikki, take it away. All right. Hey, guys. I am Nikki. Thank you so much for joining us this afternoon, evening. You guys, I'm a market mentor with Money. Um, market mentor, that is six out of 10 ranks for you guys that don't know anything about our ranks. You guys, that's me using money for two years, really just being intentional with the business for about a year and a half. And I'm going to tell you a little bit about how I got started. And then we're going to talk about the money because I feel like that is what people want to hear about is the money. So I fell in love with money off of a sample. I had a girlfriend um, throw it out there on social media. Who wants to try a sample? I don't know about you, but I'm up <laughs> for anything and a good deal. So I was like, me, send, send me the sample. Um, you guys, I'm so super frugal. I fell in love after one wash and I dropped 200 bucks just to get the biggest discount. Zero intentions of selling. I worked four jobs when I first signed and hit that submit button. I had zero intentions. When people say, I'm too busy. I was the girl that was like, I'm too busy to do this. So I worked in reproductive medicine full time. I was a postpartum doula. You guys, I would work my full day and then I would go over to somebody else's house and help them with their newborn and spend the night, go back to work the next day. You guys, I ran a mom's group at our local hospital. And on top of all of that, I drove for a lift. So I had no time. You guys, my hair was crap as well. I have thyroid issues. My hair was thinning. I had an oily scalp. My ends were dry. I washed my hair daily. I used heat. The damage was there. I always use good quality products. You guys, I never went cheap on my products. I never spent money on myself unless it was for my skin and my hair. So I was spending hundreds of dollars but my hair would get fatigued after three months. I don't know if you guys have ever dealt with that. You'd, you'd get something that your stylist would recommend. You'd fall in love with it, be so super nice. And then three months later, your hair looked like crap. I was expecting that with Monet, to be completely honest. I was used to spending the money, but I just knew that I probably wouldn't love it after three months. I had nothing to lose, right? I was already spending the money. I kind of figured I'd get tired of it. Um, I started sharing it with friends and family a little bit here and there. Again, I had zero intentions of selling, but when your hair is changing in front of people's eyes, like for me, I didn't really notice it so much because you see your own hair every single day, right? It's kind of hard to acknowledge. I like, I knew I wasn't washing it as often, but people were physically seeing the change. And so they were asking me about it. I was sharing my link. So I think $15 here. $20 there. And I'm like, all right, you know, that's like a tank of gas or like some Starbucks for the month. It's pretty cool. I told my upline, don't even ask me to sell zero, zero, zero intentions of selling. Okay. She asked me to go to an event. All right. Missy's going to talk about the community, but she asked me to go to an event. And in my eyes, I was thinking, okay, girls weekend, like no husbands, no kids. She knew what she was doing. She invited me to this event where I was gonna meet these like-minded women that were just like me, you guys. These are women that some of them didn't go to college. I didn't go to college. Some of them were driving free Cadillacs. Like I wanna be driving a free Cadillac. Um, my friend, Michelle, who I had just met her for the first time there, she had retired her husband after like a year and a half. So I was thinking, okay, if these like very normal average women could be doing this, why couldn't I do it? Like I'm accidentally kind of making 15 to 20 bucks, you know, every week here. Let's like, let's see what happens when I start being intentional with it. So you guys, that was the day that I made the decision to start making this a business. At the time, again, I worked four jobs. So I was fitting it into the nooks and crannies of my day. So like an hour a day, maybe two hours a day, I was fitting it into my lunch break. And my job here is to talk to you guys about money. So I'm going to be very open about the money aspect of it. I was averaging about $500 a month at that time with spending about an hour, I would say a day. 
not too shabby for a part-time gig, right? Like $500 a month, like that's pretty nice. Like that was paying my car payment, was paying my groceries. That was really nice. Um, what wasn't nice, you guys, is at my day job that I was working 40 hours a week, they had a accident with payroll one day. People's lives were shook. Like people were freaking out. They were not getting paid. I was not freaking out, you guys. I got paid with Monate. Granted, it was only like, you know, I was only averaging about $500 a month, but that adds up. So I was not freaking out because I had that second set of income. You guys, I got laid off with COVID, just like probably 90% of the rest of the world. So very quickly, my part-time side hustle turned into my only source of income last March, okay? So that's when the fear really came in. That's when I freaked out because my part-time job is now the only way I'm able to pay my bills. You guys, now a year later, I am making about eight times what I was making a year ago, legit. Um, I really feel like that first year of my business was me laying the foundation and now I'm able to fully support my family with just money. I quit every other job that I was doing. I got laid off with reproductive medicine. I stopped being a postpartum doula. I stopped the mom's group at the local hospital and I stopped driving for Lyft. I only share money. That is all I do right now. So let's. That's me in a nutshell. And I want to talk to you guys about money, the money, the compensation plan, and a little bit about a program called Smart Start. Okay, you guys, I'm a visual person. Um, I don't know if you guys have ever watched me before, but I like to get fun with like either Legos or wine and talk about Smart Start. Um, I found out last minute that my huge board that I was going to use to like get all creative about Smart Start is not magnetic. So I have my very little tiny little board here to um, talk to you guys about Smart Start. But Smart Start is a way that Monate helps you be successful with your business by offering you so many bonuses in the very beginning when you sign up. So if you guys are watching this video with us today and you're like, oh my gosh, you guys are so inspiring me. I have to go sign up today. You are going to get this opportunity to do Smart Start, which is the rest of the month that you signed up. So you'd get all the rest of this month. You'd get all of the next two months. You get the rest of October, all of November, and all of December. And that is something that is called Smart Start. Okay. So I'm going to show you what the bonus potential is. So Money wants you to feel that love right in the beginning. They want to show you that this business really has income potential. And so they give you every opportunity to essentially make unlimited money in the first three months of your business. So I also want to tell you that this is the best time to sign up with money. Okay. We're in the fourth quarter, October, November, December is money's busiest season. Okay. We're in the holidays right now. Um, we have the most sales we will ever have throughout the entire year, they drop them this time of year. Like I remember last year and like, we don't know what the sales are. I have no idea what they're going to drop, but just going off of my history from last year and the year before, like legit, we were having flash sales or some sort of new thing happening like every single week. So like, this is the time that we are in momentum and people are excited. We've got Black Friday. We've got Cyber Monday. We have different holiday specials that we drop. We have like different things that we drop with money that are unique that you can only get right now and people like that's what they thrive for and that is what they are after and that's what people sign up for last month we dropped cbd for like a hot minute we might bring that out again and people get really excited for that so if you're ever thinking about trying a side business like now legit is the time to do it so back to smart start Okay, so when you're in your new business, you are in your warm market, it is really easy for you to get excited. You're washing your hair with this product, you're washing your face, you're trying out the wellness. You can't help but be excited and share it with your friends and family. Like you're still in your warm market. It is so easy to sign up your first four VIPs, right? Because you're talking to your mom, your sister, your neighbor, your best friend, like so it is so super easy to sign up your first four VIPs. Okay, so let's talk about commission. You make 
15% commission off of your VIPs. And that's roughly depending on what they sign up. I would say anywhere from about 15 to $20, give or take. So you've got your 20, 40, 60, you got your $80 off of your first four VIPs. So that's what you're gonna make no matter what. Okay, so let's get that up there. Money, when you are in Smart Start, they are gonna give you $60 bonus when you get those four VIPs. So you've got your $60 bonus. What is awesome is after Smart Start, you still get that $60 bonus if you sign up for VIPs in a month. That never goes away. So that's super exciting. That part is not um, special to just the Smart Start. All right. So now you're like starting to feel the money. You're getting really excited because you signed up your first four VIPs. So then you're talking to your best friend and you're like, girl, I'm making some money with this. You need to be making some money with this too. So you sign her up with the biggest product pack. It's called the I Want It All product pack. You are gonna make 100, 200, 20, $30 just off that product pack bonus, okay? So you've got your $230. That is a block, four VIPs, one market partner. That's a block. Money is gonna say, you're so good. You're so good at selling shampoo. I'm gonna give you $150 for getting that block. So that's a block bonus. So super easy. You've got your four war market people that are super excited to change their hair. You've got your best friend selling with you. You've got your first block. You are filling that momentum. You're gonna do it again. So you're gonna get another $80 commission. All right, look at that, all that money. You're gonna get another $60 for getting those four VIPs. You guys, you're still in your warm market. You're excited, you're sharing this with everybody. You're gonna sign up now, your best friend. You've got somebody making money with you. You're gonna start to feel the community. So it's so super easy. People are watching you on social media and they're like, I want that. She's making money, sign me up. I've got strangers that I've never met before on my team just because they saw how excited I was about the business. So you sign up that person that you've never met before with the I want it all pack. That is another $230. You guys, you are on fire at this point. So Monet is going to give you another $150 because you're awesome. You're rocking the shampoo business. All your friends and family are excited for you. Look at all that money. If you do that one more time, you guys, you're getting the commission. You get 15% commission. You're going to get your $60. For signing up your four VIPs. Oh my gosh, look at all that money. You're going to sign up your other best friend or maybe your sister or maybe your mom. They want it all as well because why not? You get the biggest discount you are ever going to get with signing up to be a market partner. It's upwards of like 57% off the products. Why not get the biggest product packs? So you're going to get another $230, but and then Monet is going to give you another block bonus for $150. Look at all that money. We're not done yet. You got three blocks. That is a Mo neighborhood, you guys. I know it's a cheesy saying. We are all about <laughs> the cheesy things, and that's okay. But you're going to get a $500 bonus just for rocking your shampoo business and getting three blocks. You guys, how much money is up there? I had to get out a calculator because I was like, that's a lot of money. That is $2,060, and that is unlimited, you guys. I've heard of people getting like three blocks, four blocks, five blocks, 10 blocks, like five money neighborhoods. You can do that as many times as you want, and when you guys are in this business when you're first starting, it is so super easy to make those bonuses, okay? And let me talk about not only are they unlimited, when you get your first two blocks, that ranks you up to the very first rank, which is MMP, and you get a ranking bonus, you guys. That is also $100, so that you can get your ranking bonus on top of that. Um, money is so super generous. You guys, I've never done network marketing before this. Again, I didn't even know I wanted to do it until I knew I wanted to do it. I didn't really look into the compensation plan, but you guys, I did the research after I started because I've had people come at me and wanting to know the facts about how much money is it 
in this business. You guys, Mani is so super generous. They give us 50 cents back on every dollar to the market partner. You make 30% commission off of your retail customers, 15% off of your VIP customers. You get rank bonuses averaging anywhere from $100 up to $20,000. Okay, you guys, I just ranked up to Market Mentor this last month. My bonus just for getting that rank up was $1,000. Okay, so we're going to put the disclaimer on this video when I'm done because I am... I'm telling all the secrets and talking about money and I can do that as long as I put our disclaimer on here. Okay. I'm an open book. My team knows that I'm an open book. Okay. If you decide to have a team working with you, you get their matching bonuses as well up to the fifth rank. Okay. So my girl, I just got Kristen up to MMB this last month. She got a $500 bonus. I got that bonus too, you guys. So Money is all about the bonuses. They want to see you be successful. They want you to feel the love. Not only do they stop at the money, trips. Okay, I'm going to touch on the trips a little bit. I am on my fourth trip that I'm working towards right now. And a lot of times people come at me thinking like trips, okay, that's great, but only like the very top of the, you know, the top of the compensation plan can earn those trips. Not true. I have girls that are still in their smart start and they're qualifying for Vegas and they are gonna get there. Like we're only halfway through the qualifications for Vegas, but I've already, this is my fourth trip. Okay. If COVID didn't get in the way, <laughs> I would have already went to Vegas and the Dominican. I think I'd be in Dominican right now. I don't even know. I think we would be like maybe, oh no, Dominican would have been next month, but you guys, I earned Dominican for me and my husband absolutely free, fully paid for. Okay. Vegas, I earned it. I'm going in two weeks with my team. Okay. That is fully paid for. I went to Palm Springs before um, COVID happened. That wasn't money specifically um, like hosted. It was my upline um, did a leadership summit. So we do those as well. So that one was like halfway paid for, but the trips, people think they're hard to earn, but they're not. Um, new market partners are earning it. And you guys, I'm a year and a half into this business, working it intentionally, and I'm working on getting my Cadillac. So stuff like that is attainable. Okay. You have to lay your foundation. I'm not going to tell you that it is easy, but the work is simple. Just because I do money full-time does not mean it has to be your full-time jam. It could just mean for you to have that second stream of income it can be your holiday money. It could be just like your extra fun money. I have some girls that just want to be able to, you know, go on girls weekends and not have to worry about spending the money with me right now, with everything going on in the world. Like I love that I'm able to stay at home with my son while he's homeschooling. I couldn't even imagine what some of these other moms are doing that have to leave the house and go to work every day while their young children are at home trying to deal with school on their own. So for me, like that has been the best thing about doing this business full time. And, and like, if there are any of you guys out there are moms as well, like just think about what a peace of mind that would be to be able to have that second stream of income God forbid something were to happen if the world falls apart again, like if you do get laid off, like maybe you didn't get laid off. What if you do get laid off? Like having that second stream of income could really be the peace of mind that you have been seeking after. So um, I want to share a little bit with you before I wrap it up and pass it back on over to Missy. Um, some of the fears I had getting into this business and how I overcame those and how I have gotten to the point in my business of where I'm at today and how I feel like I'm successful. You guys, um, I didn't have any fears when I started and that's just the God's honest truth because I wasn't going to do the business. So I didn't have any fears hitting submit. I knew I just wanted the biggest discount. So you have nothing to lose. At the very end, you don't have to sell. You could just get the biggest discount. And that was kind of the best of both worlds for me is I got the best discount. My hair was changing for the better. And when I was ready to do the business, it was there for me waiting. Okay. So I'm the type of person, I don't care what people think about me. If you know me, you love me for that. I'm very blunt. 
Um, I wasn't worried about people judging me for being in network marketing because guess what? I was confident in the products. My hair was changing. People were seeing it. I was confident in the company and I was confident in my community um, that I had joined. And now I'm confident in the community that I've built. Um, I have the best friends. Like I've always been the type of girl that um, I'd have one really good friend my entire life. And that was it. And if she wasn't available, like I was a loner, <laughs> you guys, I have like 50 of the bestest friends. And that's just my close ones. I have like hundreds of thousands of really, really close friends. Missy's going to talk about the community a little bit um, further, but you guys, my biggest fear when I actually got intentional with this business was um, really, it didn't fall into place until I got laid off because before that, this was just extra money for me. Like there was no fear with that. Now this is my only source of income. I have nothing else coming in other than my mom ate money. You guys, I just got paid today. We get paid five times a month. We get paid every Friday and then on the 15th. Okay, they dropped the 15th commissions a day early. I love when they do that. You guys, my check today covers two months of my bills. Okay, so I know that I don't have to stress about money this month and next month. So now I can just throw everything to the wayside and just really focus on my team and my business. So that is the peace of mind that I have. Um, so how I overcame my fear, you guys, was not giving up. I legit just made sure that I showed up every single day. Um, this work, again, it's not easy, but it's simple. And I truly, truly believe that if this is something that you're thinking about doing, you can be successful with just two things. Okay, these are my secrets right here. I'm going to let them out to you. Don't tell anybody, okay? Two things. It is consistency, showing up every day. I don't have to show up every day and talk about money, but I just have to show up every day, okay? So consistency and follow up, okay? If I send out a sample, I'm going to follow up with you and just following up when people have questions, okay? And the last thing, my bonus is never stop learning. Okay. The truth is people want to watch you fail. Okay. People want to watch me fail. And even my best friends and my family, they're probably in that crew of wanting to watch me fail. Okay. That's just human nature. People want to see you get bored with it. They want to see you give up after a few months. They want to see after smart start, what's going to happen to you, right? You just have to keep showing up. And that's what you have a team for. You don't have to do this stuff on your own. You don't have to recreate the wheel. You don't have to know everything. That's what you have the community for. And that's what Missy is going to talk to you about is because we don't want you to have to recreate the wheel. We don't want you to have to start over. We don't want you to know everything from day one. That is what you have the community for. All right. I'm going to turn it over before I turn it over. I personally am giving away one of my favorite things. It is a blackhead vacuum remover. Okay, so we do skincare. So this is just a little bit of an extra thing to help you out with your skincare routine. And all I'm going to ask you to comment is because I love Christmas and I want to help you guys have some extra money to help pay for the holidays. I want you just to comment below your favorite Christmas gif. Is that how you say it? Gif? Giffy? GIF, I don't even know, but you know what I'm talking about. Comment below and we're going to pick our winners in 24 hours. So we want to give you guys time to watch the replay. Just comment below and you will be entered to win. I will pick the winner. I will pick them tomorrow. Okay. Thank you guys for listening to me. It was um, a pleasure talking to you and I'm going to turn it back over to Missy. Hey everyone. Uh, hold on just a sec. I have to close this out because if I look down and up, it it's kind of throwing me off. Anyway, so guys, my name, some of you know me, some of you don't. My name is Missy. I have been part of Monet now for, it will be a year doing the business on November 1st, but using the product since October 16th, 2019. So it's pretty crazy. Um, so I want to give you a little story, a little background on me. Before Monet, I had tried several other companies. I think I counted it out and it was like six or seven different um, marketing companies. Never ever was successful with any of them. Um, there was a lot of things that I don't feel that were for a new person starting out that they had an opportunity to learn about. There wasn't a lot of education. There wasn't a lot of trainings. It was just kind of like, I almost felt like you were kind of thrown to the wolves, wolves, figure it out for yourself kind of concept. 
Um, or maybe it was a product that there was other products that were comparable to it. So it was a little hard for me. Um, and so after I've done after having done so many different types of things, I mean, I did, um, I did skincare stuff. I did, uh, weight loss stuff. I did, um, just nutrition stuff. I mean, you could probably pretty much name it. I probably tried it at some point. And I was very disappointed. I was like, every, I saw all these people making money and I was like, what's wrong with me? Why can't I ever do this? And I really do believe that it, it, you are only as good as your leaders and you are only as good as your weakest person on your team. Um, so with that being said, I was like, I am never, ever, ever going to do marketing ever again. I'm done with sales. I never, ever want to have anything to do with this ever again. And so um, <laughs> I never made money with them either, guys. Like I dished in a lot of money, never made nothing. It was, it was, it was very, very sad. Anyway, so I was a nurse. I still am a nurse. Um, and so I was just like, I'm just going to focus on my job. So probably about two years ago, two and a half years ago now, well, maybe it's more like three now that I think about it, I decided that I needed to find a way to make a little bit more money. Um, I really liked the nursing field, but I wanted to try something different. And I really, working in an ER, we see a lot of patients that probably could be seen in the clinic, but it's sad because in our area, we lack providers. We lack family practice. Um, they have a hard time getting in. It can take months to get in. And they're like, you know, maybe they have strep or, you know, something else going on that needs to be addressed within a day or two. And we just, we weren't, we didn't have enough providers in the area. So I was like, you know what? I really want to have my own patients to take care of my own patients to manage. I really love patient care. Um, and I like building relationships with that person and that trust. And I really like the long-term management of, um, of a patient. So, cause then you get to know them and you can make changes as you need to. So I was like, you know what, I'm just going to do family practice. Um, and plus I was going to work with, you know, eventually I want kids and all that. So I just felt like it was going to work better. So I decided to go back to school and I was like, I can do this full-time nursing thing and go to school full time, this is doable, you know, and I do photography. So I was like, okay, so then my photography can kind of substitute. But I quickly learned that once I started doing clinicals, it was going to be very demanding. There was a lot of papers we had to write on top of doing papers, we had clinicals and then our clinicals had papers. Um, it was just a lot of schoolwork, a lot of research, a lot of studying, and a lot of reading. And I wanted to make sure I understood things properly. So at that point, I was like, well, I I don't know what to do. I'm, I'm at a standstill right now because part of me is like, I really just need to drop down part-time or PRN as a nurse so I can focus on school. But then I was like, oh my gosh, how am I going to make my bills? Um, and this was about like August, September of last year. And I remember reaching out to my mom because I just got off shift as an ER nurse and I called her and I was like, all these girls at work, they have the most beautiful hair and my hair looks like I just grabbed a bunch of grease and slathered it across. It's very thin. It's stringy and gross. And I literally just washed my hair the night before and it's completely already saturated in oils and whatever from my natural scalp oils or whatever. And so I was really frustrated. I was, I had tried so many salon grade products. I tried so many things out there. Nothing worked for me. I was completely done guys. Um, my confidence was shot. You know, I just there, I was not in a good place. Let's just put it that way. Um, I was getting depressed. I was getting sad. I was getting anxious. Um, I was feeling really down on myself with gaining weight and then my hair not looking very good. And then in addition to that, like stressing about how I was going to make ends meet with both having to stay full time and work as a nurse and 
do some of my photography stuff, which photography is my outlet, guys. So I love photography. It's one of my favorite things to do. But unfortunately, there's a lot of photographers in the area. So it's hard to get people to book because um, a lot of them are really good. We're all really good. We have different styles, but it's it makes it a little bit more challenging. So I couldn't just rely on that. Um, so anyway, I started on the Monet products because my aunt told me, you know, hey, just try them out. I told her, I said, I'm not going to sell this. Do not ask me. I'm never doing a marketing company again. This is never happening. It is never happening. They don't work. Well, about 14 days in, I reached out and I was like, how do I do this market partner thing? And she was like, uh, what? And I was like, how do I do this market partner thing? She's like, I thought you said you never wanted to sell. And I was like, well, it's really helped my boyfriend's hair. It's starting to help my hair. You know, I want to help other people with their hair. And even if I make an extra four to 500 bucks a month, that would allow me to at least drop down part time as a nurse. Guys, little did I know how many people had hair care problems and hair issues and running into the same exact issue I was, which was trying so many different things, nothing working and stress. And, you know, they just want something that will work. And I was able to help a lot of my friends, a lot of my family and friends of friends. And from there, my business, I literally just shared and my business just started growing. And here's the crazy thing, guys. I started in November, which was the best time. October, November is the best time to join this company because you have such a huge opportunity. We have some of the best sales because of Christmas and Black Friday. Um, it's just crazy sales. So people really like to snatch them up. It's a really good opportunity for customers to even sign up during that time because they get on, in on some amazing specials, which is awesome. So since then, within about five months, I completed my Mo neighborhood for one. Within five months, I hit MMB, which is top 3% of the company. Within seven months, I hit AMM, which is the next rank up. And just last month, I hit Market Mentor. And just so you guys know, Nikki's my little um, travel, I like to call her my little travel buddy. And Monet, um, since we've connected, I feel like we've gotten a lot stronger as leaders and I feel like we've really played off of each other. So she's like my Monet companion, if you want to call her. <laughs> um, so she's, she's become, she's somebody that I met during Monet and developed a very strong uh, friendship with. So the, the friendships that you make in this company will last you a lifetime guys we live in a society and it's so sad we live in a society where people get pleasure and bringing other people down um talking bad about them bringing down how they look um just bringing them down in general like oh yeah you're nothing or you know and Really, we should be lifting each other up, especially during this time. We have to support each other. And having been in that dark place where I just felt really sad, I felt really lonely and stressed, um, Monet could not have come at a better time because I have met some amazing ladies. Let me tell you. And even our uh, leaders, our people that are moving to the top of the company, they, a lot of, in a lot of other companies, they don't interact with you. They want nothing to do with you. You're nothing. You're the little person, right? Not in Monet, not in Monet at all, because I have developed a very strong friendship with Michelle and she is a executive director in the company. So she's one rank away from the top, top part, hardest part of the company. And then Natalie, um, guys, they have become such good friends of mine. I can talk to them, whatever I need. I can vent to them. It doesn't even have to be about Monet, which is awesome. Even Nikki, like it does not have to be about Monet. I can just sit there and vent to them about life in general. I'm stressed. I feel like I'm going to have a mental breakdown or whatever. Oh my God, you won't believe what happened today. I'm so stressed out about this. And it's nice to have that support system because in a society that we live in today, there, there isn't 
very many people that you can really lean on when things are not necessarily going the way you want them to. And I can honestly say with the community within Monet, like we are so supportive. We are literally like a huge family. We root each other on for every success and it doesn't even have to be Monet related. We're there for each other whenever we're feeling down or upset about something. Like I could not ask to be part of a better group of women, people, you know, it's, it's been an absolute godsend. So pathway, I want to talk about how our, our team is different than any other team you could possibly imagine. So one of the things that I've learned along the way, having been in other companies is nobody paves a pathway to success for you. They just kind of throw you to the roof. They just say, they might give you a little hints like, oh yeah, just post about products or just post about this or just post about that. Oh, maybe a couple testimonies, whatever, right? Well, with Monet, like our team will give you all the tools. Like when I say all the tools to be successful, I literally mean it down to how to talk to people, how to follow, like how to, what to recommend and when. Um, and if you don't know how to, what to recommend or you're questioning yourself, like your upline is so supportive. They will tell you exactly how to respond back to somebody. Like if you're like, oh my gosh, I got a hair quiz or um, I got somebody interested in the product. You can message us and we will tell you exactly what to respond back. And if you're like totally just drawing a blank and you're like, I have no idea what to say at all we tell you exactly what to respond back and we help you with that. So you're never, ever alone. Like we will help you close out um, VIPs and retail customers and market partners. Like we never, ever, ever leave our, our, our team alone. We are always there for them, no matter what they need. We do a lot of team trainings and this is not just team trainings on products. This is team trainings on how to be successful in the business. We give you tips, tricks, and I think all of us in this call can also say we as leaders also create a content calendar for you. So things to talk about each day, post. And if you don't know what to talk about, if you're like, oh, okay, what is this? Like, what is this product? Or what does, what are the four ways that you can make money with Monet? Whatever the case may be, you can reach out to us and we'll tell you and we'll help guide you um, to get through that. And we even launch you with a launch party. Like you are literally like, we do everything for you. Ask my team, ask their team. Like I'm telling you, we will be there for you every step of the way until you get to, even, even if you get to a point that you're comfortable, we are still going to be there every step of the way, but we will hold your hand until you're like, you know what? I got this now you know what? I'm ready to start building my team. I'm ready to start doing this. I feel very confident in this, but as long as you don't feel confident, we are going to hold your hand through the whole entire process. Um, so I really love about that. So we do give you guidance. Um, our leaders are very, they really motivate us um, on so many levels. They'll give us challenges to do. Um, they'll guide us if we have questions. Like I can still reach up to Natalie or Michelle and be like, hey, I don't know how to do this. What would you recommend? Or what would you recommend for me to target this type of audience or whatever the case may be. And they will throw ideas out to you like, no, tomorrow guys, like, yes, you could do this or you could try this or you could do this. And if I'm like, well, I don't know how to do X, they'll be like, this is how you do it. This is what you will do. I seriously have never been part of a team that has been as supportive and caring as this one. Um, we, the biggest thing guys, people always like, oh, I don't like to sell. I, I don't know how to sell, or I don't even know where to begin. And the thing is we don't sell we share. So there's a huge difference with that. We do not sell, we share. Literally, I share my results. I share results of other people. I share results of my team. I share what Monate has done for me as a business. I share what Monate has done for my team as a business and for others as a business. That is all I do. And I let people reach out to me 
and then they instigate the conversation. So it's not like I'm just cold calling people, um, just cold calling strangers, none of that. Like we let them come to us, which is awesome. Um, making sure I hit all the points, the most important points. Overall, guys, our community is probably going to be one of the strongest communities you could ever be part of. Like I said, ask our teams. They, we are, we are like a big family and I cannot wait until this whole um, COVID thing is over so we can all get together and, you know, maybe grab drinks or hang out and just talk because seriously, these girls have become part of my family and I know that if I ever need anything or ever have a question about anything I can message them at any point in time and they will be there to support me so I do want to go on to fears um like Nikki was talking about so one of my biggest fears about joining this company was failure because I had been in so many other companies and I had worn out my market at least I felt like I did um I was like you know I've already talked to my friends I've hit up my friends when I joined these other companies I've done this I've done that nobody's gonna want to buy from me I mean I've, I've sold this before and nobody bought from me right and so I was really scared that it was going to be a bust but if you go in with that mentality you will never be successful in this business so I had to change, I had to do hard switch of my mindset. And I said, you know what? Even if nobody buys from me, the product is amazing. I would use it on my dogs, my boyfriend. If I had kids, I would use it on my kids. I use it on myself. Like I just wanted to help people. And even if I didn't get a sale, I wanted to share because I was like, this is one of the best products I've ever come by. Um, and it's actually been part of the reason I've tried to switch more to natural products and natural things, body wash, uh, deodorant, all of that because of Monet um, and learning everything I've learned. So when I switched my mindset and I said, you know what, no matter what, I'm never going to stop sharing. Even if I'm sad, even if I'm down, even if my business is not taking off like I want it to, I just got to keep sharing no matter what, because I want to help other people. And I feel like that reflects um, when I talk to people. I feel like that reflects when I go in my group or on my personal page, because I am passionate about the products. And I quickly learned that if you're not passionate about something, you cannot sell it. And I will say that this is the first product I've ever been truly passionate about where I was like, even if I don't make a dime from this, I'm going to continue with this. So once I overcame that fear, my business just exploded, guys. I, um, I did not feel my confidence went up. I started feeling like, you know what? I am changing people's lives. And I love getting those little texts of like, oh my gosh, you know, my hair is so different now in a good way. It looks amazing. My hair holds a curl. My hair is so shiny. It's so soft. You know what? I have some curls I haven't seen in years. You know, I love getting those texts. I love helping people with their hair. And the money is just an added bonus for me. Um, so I can tell you as well, since I hit market mentor and we are going to put the income disclosure on here, I can say that when I first started my average income uh, for probably the first two to three months was about 500 to $600, which was good for me because I was able to pay for Christmas and buy Christmas presents and make some extra bills. And then as time went on, my page started getting bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger and my team started growing and everything started spiraling um, just in bonuses alone um, which Nikki talked about I also got an extra thousand dollar bonus um, plus I also got something called founder shares which I'm not going to tell you how much that was but let's just say I'm very pleased with my paycheck it is the biggest paycheck I've had with Monet so far and it is enough money to be able to probably pay my bills for the next four months. 
my all of my bills for the next four months. That's which is huge. Um, it has literally allowed me to drop down PRN as a nurse and live still very, 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 very comfortably in my life and focus on school and not stress about, oh my God, where is this going to come from? So, and once again, when COVID hit, it was a godsend. I'm telling you guys, this is the best time to join. So um, I'm also going to do a giveaway. I'm grabbing it right now. So to be entered in to this giveaway right here sorry my dogs are going to jump on the bed it is a set of samples it's a little hair tie a microfiber towel a uh, shower cap white tooth comb and a set of uh, hair care stuff customized to your hair a sample set so to be entered in for that i want you using a gif i want you to comment or put in a gif your favorite Thanksgiving dish that you're like, it gets you excited when Thanksgiving comes around. So with that being said, I want to introduce Stephanie. She is amazing, guys. You are going to love her. She is going to talk about flexibility because honestly, guys, flexibility is everything. You don't want to like spend your whole life working 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Okay. So flexibility is amazing. So I'm going to go ahead and pass it on to Stephanie. Yay. Hi guys. Um, thank you all. I am compared to, um, Nikki and Missy. I am the newbie of the group. Um, so I have only been doing this for about six months. Um, and uh, Nikki and Missy are ones that I strive to be. I strive to be like them eventually. So one day I will get there. Um, but a little bit about me. Um, I am a wife and a mom to two boys. Um, I ha have, you know, a four month old puppy. I have a cat. I have, you know, I am staying home doing the homeschooling thing with at least my oldest at the moment, since the youngest is going into school. Um, and I now work, um, also full time. I just started, two weeks ago, a new job um, that is full time, mostly remote at this point. Um, but um, it has been a big change. Um, and I have still been able to weave uh, Monate into my new life um, with this new job. Um, so I started uh, a little bit about um, my Monate journey. I started back in 2018. I was a VIP. Um, I had a friend from college that I had you know, stayed in touch with on Facebook. And I saw her posting about, um, you know, her hair journey and how she has started using it and started selling it um, and how her hair had changed, um, especially post kids um, with the postpartum hair loss and all that kind of stuff. And she started using Monet and it was worlds different. Um, one day she offered me samples and I was took her up on that. And that's when I decided to join um, as a VIP. I noticed, um, similarly to Nikki, I noticed the difference within the first wash. Um, you know, my hair was always, uh, it's always fi been fine. It's still fine. It's um, much softer now. Um, but, um, but the frizz is the big difference that I noticed within that first wash and it's continued. I don't have to do anything um, to my hair to help that frizz go down. This is just blow dried um, with the blowout cream and that's it. And um, that's what had me sold on um, everything from the beginning. Um, I had no intentions to sell. Like I said, I started as a VIP um, and that was November of 2018. This past April, so 2020, almost two years. So it was about a year and a half later, I finally decided um, to upgrade to market partner. Um, I hadn't had a job in a year um, and it was getting to the point where I was starting to get worried. And so I decided, you know, I use the products. I love the products. I have a couple of friends who are using the products. Why not give it a shot? What's the worst that could happen? Maybe make a few extra bucks on the side to help ease my mind a little bit um, until I do get a, you know, a full-time job in the future. And so I started, um, you know, one of the excuses that um, you hear a lot is that is the money and you're not ready and this and that. And it's $200 to start your, um, your, to start your investment with Monate. Um, you know, the first, the lower product pack, the essentials pack is $199. Um, it gets you what you need. You can use all the products for yourself. 
Um, and let me tell you, I made that $200 back within the first month um, and more. And that's thanks to Smart Start, like Nikki was talking about. I never thought I would do that. I never thought I would build them a neighborhood. Um, I never thought I would get all those bonuses, um, but it happened. I mean, it's word of mouth, it's sharing it with your friends and it really does work. And so, and this business, anyone can do it. I hate, I'm gonna go into my fears now as I'm talking about it. Um, I hate social media. I am not a social media person because I don't like putting my face out there. I'm not a selfie person. I'm not a video person. I don't like lives like this. <laughs> Um, but, um, uh, yeah, you know, it's, it's just something that you, when you sit there and think about it, you just do it. No, one's going to, no, one's going to get on you for it. Um, you push it out of your mind and you just basically, you have to suck it up and do it. Um, and I'm working on that and I'm starting to suck it up and do it. And it gets easier, believe it or not, it gets easier and easier every time. Um, uh, you know, someday I'll be able to go live every day. Maybe who knows? Maybe not. We'll see. <laughs> but, um, but you just have to sit, you just have to understand that, um, you, the longer you are doing this business, the, the more you are learning, you're constantly learning, the more, you know, and the more comfortable you will, will get. And that's, that was my biggest thing is that, you know, I'm not a hairstylist. I don't know anything about hair. I don't know anything about skin. I wash my hair and I wash my face, um, but I'm not one that, you know, sits there and knows every little thing about all the things and whatnot, but Monate prepares you for that. Um, and as long as you're doing your due diligence and reading up on what the products are and using the products and understanding what they are and putting out there what you like, it's easy. You talk about what you love and going live and doing the social media thing and talking about all of this is just, it becomes second nature. Um, um, where else was I going with all this? Uh, so, um, Another excuse, since I'm on excuses, that uh, which was one of my main excuses was that I didn't have time. Well, that was obviously a lie since I didn't have a job anyway. I was just taking care of myself and the children and my husband. Um, and so, um, so finally after that year and I decided, okay, I might as well give it a shot. I do actually have the time. You work it in as you go. You can take five minutes here and there. If you're on Facebook, I'm always scrolling around Facebook, whether it's first thing in the morning when I wake up or at night when I'm going to bed or even during TV when I'm watching TV, um, whether it's with the kids or, you know, with my husband or um, whatever it may be. As if I'm scrolling for, through Facebook, I might as well be putting up a post or messaging um, VIPs um, or, you know, potential clients, potential, potential customers and things like that. Uh, you know, you can take a few minutes a day to do, um, it takes five minutes to do a video um, on a product or a tutorial or anything like that. I mean, you can literally work it into every part of your day. Um, even if you have a full-time job, do it during your lunch break or before you start in the morning or, uh, you know, do it when you have an afternoon break for a minute or two. Um, it really is, um, it's simple, it's quick and easy. You can just work it in as you go. Um, you know, Nikki was saying in the beginning, she was doing maybe an hour a day and that's literally all it takes. Uh, to make it easier on myself because I'm a super planner. Um, I did, a, I was doing events for a living. So I'm one of those people who's like way in advance. Um, I have to plan things out. Um, I will often schedule out posts so that I don't have to think about that. And then during the actual day, I can focus on other things like messaging with customers and things like that. Um, it literally is so easy to work it into any schedule that you may have. Um, when you're sitting at a, in the car, you know, in the parking lot before you go into work, I mean, anything, literally, it's just so easy to do. Um, and, and I have also since worked it into homeschooling when my oldest is in class, you know, on his Zoom, like we're doing, <laughs> we, um, I sit there and I'm watching him as I'm working on Monate stuff, whether, like I said, it's working on um, potential customers and working out hair quizzes and sending out samples and all and taking photos for that matter of things like that. It's literally, I mean, and I know these girls can speak for it too, but you just work it in where you can and you figure it out. Um, it doesn't take that much um, extra than uh, what you're doing already as you're online, because this is social uh, this is the social selling, so to speak. I mean, like, a, you know, you're just talking about it with your friends and family and you have these conversations daily. Um, 
um, and um, being what it is, um, I'm going to echo what Nikki said earlier. Um, one of the biggest ways things to keep you successful with this is consistency. Um, and that's what I try to do every day. At least I have I have my own group and I try to post at least two posts a day, if not three, every single day on my page about a product, about you know testimonials on before and afters, things like that, um, personal stuff as well. Uh, and as long as you're consistent and bringing that through uh, daily, people are watching, people are learning, people will eventually um, speak up and say, hey, I want to try this, I want to be your next customer, that type of thing. And then the other thing that I think is super important as far as um, the secrets to, to success, so to speak, um, you know, a lot of fears come from, um, you know, what people think. Um, with you being joining in an, as an, with an MLM um, and that kind of thing. And I think as long as you're staying true to yourself and staying honest, um, I think that is what's going to make you successful um, all around. It's, um, you're, you know, I'm not going to share something that I don't believe in. Um, I'm not going to um, try and encourage you to purchase something that I don't even like to begin with. Um, and I think that as long as you stay true to yourself, you stay who you are and you be completely honest that this business is going to be for you and you will succeed and you will, uh, you will pass with flying colors. I think um, um, that that is uh, consistency and staying true to yourself is the two biggest things that you can um, learn from this business and uh, succeed in this business. Um, and that being said, I spoke really fast and <laughs> and not as much as the other two, so I apologize. Um, but I also have a um, giveaway and this one, okay, so I'm gonna, uh, I'm giving away this really cute, it's um, like an aqua color tumbler, it's a glass tumbler. Um, and in it, you will get a sample of our new, uh, from our new wellness line, it's the energy packet. Um, and um, I also threw in a little um, hair scrunchie in there. Um, and, to enter in this, just comment um, with a GIF of your favorite Halloween movie. Um, I'll say mine is Hocus Pocus. We just watched it the other night. <laughs> so put a GIF of your favorite Halloween movie if you want this. And um, like the other two, we will be doing a drawing in um, 24 hours. So if you're watching it on replay, you have time to enter. Um, and I will uh, post the winner tomorrow. Um, and other than that, I think that is all I have. Uh, Missy and Nikki, do you guys have anything else to say to close out? So I was watching the comments and I guess gifts are not loading. So to enter my raffle, um, if you want to just comment your favorite Christmas movie, that will enter you to win. And then for Missy's, if you wanna just comment your favorite Thanksgiving dish, um, that will enter you to win. Of course, try a GIF if you can. Um, and for Stephanie's, if you want to just comment your favorite um, Halloween movie. So I don't want you guys to stress out if we can't get your gifts to load. But thank you so much for joining us. Um, oh, I, I do have I one thing to add. Hold on. Yes. <laughs> I do have something to add. Okay. So I just want to real quickly talk about flexibility. There was one thing I did want to add in there. The wonderful thing with Monet is that you do make your own schedule. So if you want to go on vacation, you still get paid while you're going on vacation. If you want to, um, if you're sick and you're not feeling well, you can just take time off for that. So that's the other really good mm -hmm. thing that I did want to just touch on real quick because most of the time, if you want to take a vacation and you're working a regular job, guess who you got to ask? You got to ask the big man upstairs and be like, can I take a vacation, please? Can I get seven days off, please? You know what? I'm sick. Can I take some sick leave off, please? I'm not feeling good. Oh, nope. You've already called in two times, three times. You're getting a write-up. No, there is none of that. And the best part is you're still making money even when you're taking time off, which is the big thing with residual income guys. So with that being said, I don't know if anybody else has anything else to add, but I want to thank you all for joining us. This was amazing. Cannot wait to look at all the entries and do a drawing tomorrow. Okay. And are you guys good? Do you have anything else to add? 
I just say if anybody has any questions, um, comment below. We'll just yes. keep coming back and checking them and we can answer them. Um, and I will throw in that um, also, since I, I am so blessed to be able to do this full time, um, my favorite place to work during the summer is on my boat. <laughs> and in the winter, it's even a cabin at Mount Hood. So I'm just going to throw that out there to anybody that has goals to do Mon 8 full time. Like I will tell you, a year and a half into it, it is. I'm living my best life. I've always told my family I wanted to retire when I was 50 um, and I'm 39 years old and I'm living my best life right now. And um, thank you everyone for listening to us and taking an hour out of your night to um, entertain us and hang out with us. So thank you so much. Thank you. Yes, Bye thank guys. You guys.